Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm very excited today because I just I ordered these fill and file sleeves from Creative Memories and they just came in. They've been out of stock for quite a while and I'm really looking forward to using these. I have this bin full of borders like just packed um, after I get these few larger things. It goes right to the bottom. It's filled right to the top. They're loose, all kinds, and I have to rummage through this and it damages them when I'm looking for a border for a page. So these fill and file sleeves, I'm going to open one right now, are perfect for storing borders. <clears throat> I'm going to, um, I got two packages. I want to sort all my borders with, here we go. I want to sort my borders by color and style, like solid ones, pattern ones, that sort of thing. So these have pockets, four on, on each side. And you flip it over and there's four on the other side. So I am going to sort all my borders and then I will be able to find them easily. I am really looking forward to using these. <clears throat> I'm going to do all the reds and blues and yellows and greens and sort it all. It'll be so easy to find what I want. So I did order two packages of these and I am going to sort through but I'm not going to do it on camera. But when I'm, I'm going to do it off camera and then I'll, I'll uh, finish the video showing you what I've done. And you'll see how wonderful they are. I'm going to wait till I'm finished to see what size of binder I need to buy. I think because I have so many, the Creative Memory one is not thick enough for me. But um, it'll, it'll be uh, such a treat to have this done. Very excited. All right, well, it's taken me most of a day. I've sorted all of my borders into my fill and file sleeves. These are from Creative Memory, right? And they're in stock now. I've waited quite a while for them. They just came in stock as I'm filming this. I got mine today. Um, so I had this bin was full, absolutely full to the brim. And it is now empty. So I am delighted. I love it. So I'm going to show you how I've sorted these. Uh, I, this is all I had left and these are stickers. So they're the only ones that didn't fit in. So um, that worked really well. This I put a theme of all food porters for parties and things. And then I just sorted them by color. There's um, reds oranges, yellows, greens. I did extra pages of greens because I have so many. It is, to me, it's a neutral. I use a lot of green. And then blues, double pages of those. Pinks, purples, and browns and golds. I mixed browns and golds together and beiges. There's animal prints in this one. And then blacks and black and white, blacks and greens. And on the back, I have some miscellaneous large ones that I had. So um, I am really pleased with these. And I thought I would have to get a huge D-ring binder and I, I won't have to get a, a huge one. I'll, I'll be able to get one that's more manageable. It, I mean, it'll be, they're that thick. So I'm delighted. Now I'm gonna go out and find a binder to put them in. I know Creative Memory sells a binder, but um, it, I, I don't know that it would be thick enough because I may end up adding to these too since I do love borders so much. So um, there's a link to my Creative Memories 
website um, below. So good luck. Uh, I hope you find this helpful because it sure has solved a problem for me. Thank you for watching.